Okay, we're back. Uh, part okay. two of okay. episode nine, 18, 19? Mm-hmm. So one of those two, I think. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I don't even remember. Yeah, so you, <laughs> so you go out and make a camp on the cliffs outside of the fort. Pretty much, yeah. Like... Edvana's just sitting there crying the whole time. I'm sorry, he's such a terrible person. Maybe he's not. He, 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 he... Don't know. He loves her. Some of the worst people I've met are capable of doing some of the nicest things. They're really good at making it seem like they're nice or good or kind. Cecilia, that's that's kinder than he's ever been to me. Yeah. She's a princess. She can do a lot for him. I'm the daughter of a... Just, I just don't, I don't understand. What did I do? It's, none of it's your fault. If it wasn't my fault, then he'd treat everyone this way, and he doesn't. He just treats me this way. No, that's, n that's What did I do? <sighs> Sorry, let me... Don't blame yourself for the actions of a bad person. You don't even know him. How do you know he's bad? He's a slaver. So was I. I didn't say you were a good person. <gasps> More crying. <gasps> Tough love by Cecilia. I also didn't say you couldn't make up for it. Clearly, you have some remorse for your actions. You know those blankets? Yeah. Those blankets were on his floor because he refused to sleep in the same bed with me. Everything you're telling me just makes me hate him even more and know that he's not a good person. It's not your fault that he's a bad person. Um... So these like uh, and this this like yes go uh the out of character these it's so it's these these earrings have like a, a like are the one are the things that are like have make here have a weird they are like, a magic like, item yes can I is it a curse or is oh. it a like uh. Can you use Dispel Magic on, like, an enchanted item? Yeah. You can use Dispel Magic on anything. Okay. Uh, I am going to, um, like, hold my amulet out, like, next to the earrings and uh, do my thing to cast Dispel Magic on them. When you reach your arm out to her, she, like, looks scared. But yeah, once it becomes clear that you're casting a spell, can you go ahead and drop it in chat just so I have it? Yeah. Oh shit! Wait. Uh, it. Um. Uh. You should be able to click it. Just do. Well, it, it, dispel magic. Just just cast at level three. That's, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. There we go. Um. Yeah. So if it. Uh, I'm blah, blah, gonna blah. need a wisdom check for you. For a spell check. 
an ability check using your spellcasting ability. Right. Okay. So, bu -bu 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 -bu. do I? I never got my. So, do I get my proficiency when I'm rolling a spellcasting with my spellcasting yes, ability? Yes, because okay. your your spell it's a, it's like you're casting a spell. Okay. You roll the same thing you would roll if you were casting a spell. Okay, so I'll just it roll does, my. Okay. So I'll just. It doesn't say. I'll just roll my saving throw. That works, right? Because that's yeah. my. Does that's, your saving throw get? Yeah. I mean, check it in the box. Yeah, wisdom saving throw. So that it has roll the it. proficiency. They fall off. They just like they like they like go dim for a second and they fall off. And I like just reach around her and like pick them up and like. Uh. Are we kind of close to the cliff, or like? Yeah, you're very close. You you can walk to it. You're like ten feet away. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I I stand up, walk over to the cliff, and just toss them into the water. And come back and sit. Put my amulet back on. It's the second time you've disabled that very powerful cursed magic item. What are you gonna do? And can I point out? <laughs> we've gotten our hands on two very powerful magical magic items, items and that will make a person do. Away. That will make a person do what we want them to do. And with people who we need to make do what we want them to do. And we have decided to throw away these items instead of use them. Yes, because I'm putting my trust in them. It's better. No, like we could use that hand. <laughs> and then she draws person. her dagger and murder. Oh, no. Uh, a person. <laughs> <laughs> no, she just like she just like hugs you sobbing. Like, like, big, ugly cry, can't get words out. Mm -hmm. I'll let her do her, I'll, yeah. I'll let her do, do you, her thing. Do you, like, do, you, do you sleep at all tonight? If it's possible. Can yeah. we do, like, a four-on-four-off with, like, each other? Like for, Yeah, you could. Do, okay. You could. But, yeah, like, four-four-four. Four, like, so, so we can get a long rest, but also keep... One of one of us Watch. is up, yeah. Mm -hmm. This would be uh, a lot easier if Echo was here. Well, it's <laughs> well. Vana can definitely get a short rest. Well, Vana can definitely get a short rest. Oh yeah, she's an elf. So, a long rest. A long rest because she's, she's an elf. elf. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I just tell her, uh, yeah. I so like rest for your time, and then you keep watching. I'll rest. Like just yeah, mm -hmm. do that. So. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Um, okay. Uh, Yay, weird elf trance. All right. <laughs> All right. Let me see here. I need I need you both to roll something. Okay. Okay. And I need you both to roll constitution saving throws. Okay. Uh, does it help that we have like a bunch of our blankets and uh Well, no no no, not constitution saving throws. Um charisma saving throws. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. That's wrong. Fucking hell. Do I have inspiration that I've had? Like, yeah, for sure. Okay. Then After gonna... that scene you had with Madelon, yeah, you have inspiration. You're fine. That's better. Okay. So, Andrella, um, you have a great night with your boyfriend. Mm -hmm. There's lots of petting. There's lots of, like, massage oils and warm blankets and candles. Yes. Do you sleep at all? After... Lots of activity, yes. <laughs> okay. Make a constitution <laughs> saving throw. <laughs> Me? A yeah. constitution. Yeah. It's, you have a level you have a you have a level of exhaustion. Oh. You stayed up too late. Great. I don't know how to mark that. I don't know what it gives me. There's not like Give you disadvantage on skill checks. Okay. Yeah, exhaustion um, is like Exhaustion is rough. Yeah. So, um, you both have a dream. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with, I'm gonna start with Cecilia. Okay. Um, you have a dream where you wake up in a, um, like, you wake up in a field, and on the ground are it, it's warm and it's kind of like twilighty. Mm -hmm. um, and you you look around, and all along the floor there are um, flowers. 
And to you, they look like the roses that bloom in the desert, but there's an entire blanket of them. Uh -huh. um, and then, like, off on the horizon, you see, well, not quite on the horizon, like, at a, set, at a certain distance away, you see a, a small rise in the landscape. And on top of there, you see a figure sitting, uh, sitting at a fire. What do you do? I'll approach. Yeah, it's Kirkle. Hey, you. Hi. What? You're here. You're here? What's... Wh where's here? I'm here. I don't know. I okay. Just where I'm supposed to be, I guess. Well... Are you you weird. or are you... In my version, head version I think, of you. I think I'm me. I don't know what you're asking, Cecilia. <laughs> well, I went to sleep a while ago, so. I think I'm me. Okay. Lucid dreaming. Okay. Welcome to, welcome to the, welcome to the Shadowlands, I guess. Okay. Cool. How you. How are you doing? <laughs> What's it like being dead? Well, I'm, I'm, uh, it's weird watching your own funeral. You, oh. Thank you, by the way. Sure thing. It's also weird knowing what's going on with Andrala, but. How much do I'll get you over know? It. I'm actively choosing not to watch it right now. Wait, you... Have you been watching us this whole time? Bits and pieces. You I'm can do that? I'm still learning how to do it. Okay. Yeah, I... I, I, I tried. I know. Okay. I'm Look, sorry. I kind of knew that if we ever ended up here, that this would end up happening even if I was around. So... I'm not too. No, that's a lie. I'm 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 hurt, but I'm dead. So, who gives a fuck? He's a piece of her past, and so am I. So, no. It's Cecilia. I'm dead. I've died. I know. I'm in the past now. I know. What I'm trying to say is she has had her childhood and everything about how she grew up ripped away from her. He's a piece of that that she's latching on to. She's not thinking completely straight. It's not an excuse. But it's I, clouding I, her. I get it. I just... I failed. I... I failed, and I bonded myself to someone who doesn't care about me. Yeah, she... And... Now I will spend an eternity watching other people try and make her happy when I couldn't. stand up and walk over and give him like a ow <laughs> you can feel pain for? when you're a ghost yeah you're in the shadowlands it's like having a real body i don't care that you're dead i'm still going to knock you around if you're being ridiculous you made her happy you didn't fail Two Oni fired huge ice blasts. It's a, it's a, it's something that any of us are alive. I just drew the short straw, I guess. And I'm sorry. 
I'm glad it's me and not you. For what that's worth. She'd be fucked without you. Let's be real honest. Where the fuck is Echo? I don't. I think. I think the Fae King just kind of oh, plucked that bastard. I think he just plucked him out of just distance out or something. I don't. It, uh, really God, bad I timing. I thought being dead was weird. Yeah, it was really All bad right. timing. Really could have used. Really could have used a <laughs> half orc, half Goliath. And all those assholes <laughs> were trying to push us around. Fuck. I had to tell one to go sit in a boat. <sighs> what do you think about the new girl? She seems squirrely. Yeah. It. I. She's done some bad things, but she seems remorseful and seems like she wants to. It's hard to say make amends because doing that is just. But. Hey, I. I used to kill people for a living, I guess. Well, killing people is different than slavery. <laughs> is it? Yeah. It devalues a person. I mean... Takes their life away from them. I'm just saying, we've all done things that are morally reprehensible. Right, well, it... Anyway. Yeah, the point... Avoiding the philosophical debates. The point is... She seems remorseful. Genuinely remorseful. If she wants to... learn and grow from her past well, I can respect that and if I can help then I will if there's anybody that can help with anything in the world it's you so. well, well, it's... Did, it, did, it, did it take you dying to, to realize that or no I, I knew it from the minute you healed me in the prison uh huh uh huh Running out of time. Mm -hmm. Well, I... Trust me, tomorrow I'm going to... Oh. Okay. Yeah. I'm not I'll going hope if... to... I'll hope if I can, but I, I can't do much like this. Mm -hmm. All right, well... Love you, best friend. Me too. And then the dream ends. Andrella, you have a very different dream. <laughs> Great. Uh, you wake up uh, to the sound of like metal panging again in that same rhythmic like sound that you heard when you saw Raspin the last time, and you're in the same tunnel. Okay, I run straight towards that. Yeah, you you slam into uh, the back of a man. Whoa! <laughs> what the hell? What's this? Yeah, I, he drops his cigar and he turns around and looks at you and he's just like, Andrella, what the fuck? Who's this it's, guy? It's blue. Uh, uh, passage was not blocked last time. I'm here Sorry. for a meeting. What are you here for? <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to smoke? Sure, it was kind of good. He, it gives wasn't. A, he gives you a cigar and lights it. Go on, let's go see your grandma. She's here again? I think so. I don't know if she can see you. I think... Green does weird stuff in this place, so... I think Green saw me last time. Green sees everything. That, that girl's tricky. <laughs> feel like feel like gets like this like kind of like shit eating smile like <laughs> yeah she's tricky all right kind of thing like you maybe get the impression that they dated <laughs> yep. all right 
um, and you like you like yeah you like enter the chamber and you hear the banging. Is it still rasping? Yeah, it's still rasping. Okay. And there's okay. nobody else in the room but you right now and Blue, and he just says, "Fallen Azamar is a tragic thing, isn't it?" I'm, I, I'm going over to her. Um... She doesn't seem to really process that you're there. Like she's like looking at you, but she's still working. Mm -hmm. I didn't. I didn't know. Nobody ever told me. She never told me. It's kind of a shameful thing. Yeah, the the stories I was told about what a fallen Azamar is. Not even make, close. Make them out to be like monsters. Some of them are. Some Azamar I... fall and take so many people with them that they destroy entire countries. But all that she decided was she didn't want a lifetime of war. I'm like brushing my hands through Raspin's hair and like yeah it's like all knotted and nasty yeah. trying to fix it I mean I, I met another one in a spa house she was anything but a monster I know that one she's nice she's one of Gray's boys yeah kind of stumbled into that she healed you, didn't she? She did. I owe her a lot for that. And according to the heavenly bureaucracy, she's damned. That doesn't... There's gotta be some way for, like... Recovery, or... Not once you're dead. And even when you're alive, it takes a lot. I mean... Shouldn't it be, shouldn't it be weighed equally to the extremity of, of whatever it was? You ever read the book of angels? No, and my dad did not have that one. <laughs> There's a passage in it that is the basis for all angelic law that says that whatever sin someone commits is not comparable to another sin. Jaywalking is as bad as gang rape. Hmm. Doesn't seem right. It's not. That's why I left. Be... You left? Fallen angel, baby. You! Come on, black wings, deals with death, kind of scary, smokes a lot. I mean, not exactly Not scary, a bad but... person? I don't know you well enough to say if you're a bad person or not. But I mean, we... the ravens are their own deity. Not always. Wait, 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 wait. Do we made choices. Wait? You were an angel, and you fell and became a god? In the eyes of heaven. In my eyes, I upgraded. That does sound a bit like an upgrade, maybe. Falling upward. <laughs> Still hurt. No. An angelic law doesn't let us touch them. Couldn't save her soul if I wanted to. Couldn't save it if I tried. Raspin? Nope. She's gonna be forever in the gray wastes. She's not there now though, right? She's she's trapped in some sort of a crystal. No. Well, she's around you. She's here. Okay. Uh Odo made it sound like she was kind of being temporarily used in place of my soul. You're not wrong. But then if her soul is 
in the afterlife place, how can it be being used? Souls is weird. Okay. Well, I don't got a lot of time to explain it, but... Um, I, like, put a, a braid in Raskin's hair a little bit to keep it out of her face. Um, that's what I've been doing. I stop and I turn when he says that and I say... Do you have enough time to tell me how to find her and get her back? You need to talk to a ferryman. Hmm. Okay. I know a couple, but... Aren't you ferryman? Type? Different kind of ferryman. Okay. I go up. You're going to have to go down. Pay him in advance. Treat him with civility. What yeah. do I pay him? Whatever he asks for. But you gotta get her body fixed up first. Is... As long as that's been desecrated, not a lot you can do to the soul. Is her body... It's an icon. Okay. It's in the catacomb under the city. She made her final stand there. I was with her. Well, me and Red were with her. Couldn't do nothing, but needed to watch. Cat. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and just says, be safe, all right? Yeah. Wait, you're here for a meeting? Yep. With my grandmother. Yep. But you're fallen. Why are you two still communicating? <laughs> She's my sister. And then you what? Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> and then you wake up. <laughs> okay. You Family. just sit up in bed and scream, what? Family. I mean, <laughs> I... I I don't think I scream, but I probably like wake up wide eyed and kind of am like, oh. Yeah, yeah, naked elf arm like lies across your chest. Okay. I'm, I might be getting used to these. I might be getting the hang of it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, do we get to the next morning? Yeah, so um, sticking with Andrella, uh, Atrin wakes up and he starts getting his clothes on. Well, I woke up before him, apparently. Yeah, you broke up before him, but he, like when you wake up, he gets up. Mm -hmm. Okay. He starts trying to get his clothes on. I do the same. Just, I'll have someone bring you breakfast and a bath. Okay. Um, I need to take care of a few things. Just stay here, all right? It's safer. Yeah, um... Actually, I have a question. What the fuck are your cats doing? They're chasing each other. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no, I think it might be... So there's, a, there's an outside cat that visits. Uh -huh. And they get really excited, and they'll run from one window to another to another. They're not jumping up over here, so that might not be what it is. But they get really excited when they see somebody outside. Cool. Um, anyway, right, so I have a question. Yeah. To, to discuss, there is, a, there is a purpose behind why I came, more than just finding you. <laughs> like, I didn't... Does it have to do with... The dark elf and the... you can see him trying not to say something racist one teeth um no actually uh oh but like so if i am technically here in a diplomatic capacity to have a council session with you are there other people that would need to be present in your 
What's the scenario? My lieutenants, I'll bring them here. Go not just stay here, okay? Okay. I these are dangerous lands and I want you to be safe. I'm fine. But I you know me, I worry. And he like kisses you on the forehead and like puts his jacket on and goes out. Okay. I take a bath. Mm hmm and when you get out, there's like food that's been when you get out from behind the curtain, there's like food that's been left for you. I eat some. Mm -hmm. And uh, then I'm like, so you have to go stay and I'm not gonna have breakfast. So I set some aside for her because I'm grumbling about her behavior last night. <laughs> yeah. Um can you make a just an intelligence check? Uh oh. I wanna see if you remember something. Intelligence. Chat. Yeah, just roll intelligence. Nineteen. Yeah, so I'm um, normally smart. <laughs> you hear, you hear like, um, you hear music. Oh. It's the same song that was playing in um, Kirk Hall's mom's house. Oh, wait, what? Yeah, it's a harmonica. Okay, I get dressed. <laughs> Not quiet. Um, <laughs> Yeah, you get dressed. Um, and I'm gonna go investigate this. Am I just wearing my normal dress? Uh, it's gone. Okay. You've been left with new clothes. Uh, okay. Not weird. Yeah, it's um, uh, so it's it 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 appears to be in your size. Okay. Um, clearly recently altered. Um, it's very like purple and significantly more revealing than you're used to. It's very clearly in the Dark Elven style. Okay. Um, it's like like very strappy and it, like, cause, cause like in Everdark, sunlight is kind of a premium. Mm -hmm. And so they don't wear a lot of clothing cause they wanna like get as much vitamin D as possible. Um, and it's, it's do clearly done in that style to like be both warm and like expose as much skin as possible. I take several minutes to figure out how to put this on. <laughs> yes, that is, it's it's not simple. It's a lot of straps. <laughs> it's, a lot, it's a lot of straps. It's a lot of belts. It's like a it's like a skirt. You're not sure if the skirt is a scarf or not. It's like <laughs> I wear it as a scarf at first, and then there's like nothing on and my then, bottom and then, half, and, and there's I'm like, like a, uh... and then you you've got like a thong up by your face, and you're like, oh, this is wrong. <laughs> Force, uh, yeah. force move is a bit of a session. <laughs> yep. <laughs> um, After I finally figure out how to get dressed. <laughs> yeah. Um, I go outside. Uh, yeah, the door's the locked. Sound. Wait, what? Door's locked. I unbolt the bolts. Door's locked. Uh, uh, Knock uh, on the door. <laughs> uh, uh, that's not weird. Uh -huh. Yeah, princess. Please open the door. Matt Long cracks it and looks in. He's like, what's up? Um, I'd like to go out now. Uh, Commandant said I'm supposed to watch you and make sure you don't do anything unsafe and stay here. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can watch me. I want to go look around. Not a lot to see. Just kind of walls and snow. Posts. Okay. Who's who's making that music? What music? Okay. Is it still going? Yeah. The music. Are you feeling okay? Do, you need... Do I think that I'm insane right now? You tell me. Um. Dark elves not here at the same frequency or something? Dark elves, dark elves are exactly like humans in every way that's not specified on their character sheet and the fact that they're elven and have different chromosomes. You know what? I think I might need some fresh air. And I, I, I am pushing to get out. I, I, hold on, hold on. Before you do that, let me get you some water, okay? I'm, sometimes people get sick this far north. 
right. Just give me a minute, okay? No, 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 no. I am from this far north. <laughs> He's like, I don't know where you're... He looks at you like, I don't know where you're from, human. Your lifespan is like that of an ant compared to me. Uh, yeah, he thinks you're human, huh? Cool, 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 cool. Mm -hmm, he just says... All right, that's fine. You don't know who I am. Not a problem, but I'm from Volsenland. I'm from the north. Okay. I just need some fresh air, and I'm pushing past him. Yeah, yeah. Uh, can you roll? Like, yeah, sure. So, yeah, you, you shove past him, and you see the other woman in white standing there and she's like like looking at her like like a mirror that has like the shape of the like eye of morath painted on it and she's just looking down at it she says you're not supposed to leave that room it's for your I'm protection just as safe in that room as i am out here we can protect you inside of that room if orcs show up we can't do much Orcs won't show up. I don't know about that. I do. Um, and I'm going to start walking this way. <laughs> Where are you headed? To the west? Is this north, south, east, west? Yeah, yeah. You're heading okay. northwest. Basically away from her. I'm, I'm not having this ridiculous conversation. <laughs> she, they, they both kind of follow you. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm gonna kind of just do a wander around the place a bit. Mm hmm What do I, anything? Sure, um, yeah, uh, like, can you roll perception for me? Let's just see how close of attention you're being able to pay. Okay, because I'm like, yeah, this is what I'm doing now, so. Perception. Roll it at disadvantage. Shit. Because... I have exhaustion. Yeah, so roll it at disadvantage. Seven. Uh, I mean, it looks like a fort. There's some, like, there's, like, the, the posts are a little weird. It's very clear that people have been tied to them, but other than that, they look like posts. Okay. <laughs> Fucking exhaustion. Fucking exhaustion. Uh, Cecilia! Yeah. We, so uh... You wake up in the morning and Vaughn is gone. And you look over and you see a couple gentlemen escorting her towards the fort. Uh, um, uh, I stand, get up, and like hurry after them. Like, hey, 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 what's uh, what's going on? She just says, she looks at you. She says, I, I want to, I want to see him. Okay, sure, sure. Just gonna let these. Fine gentlemen, show you the way. I just want him to look me in the eye and tell me he loves her. Okay. You. I I, I understand why you didn't, but. Could have woke me up for this. Didn't want to bother you. And it's like she's being honest. Like she's like, no, I honestly yeah, did like, not want to bother you. Like I, this is petty and stupid, and I know I'm petty and stupid, but I didn't want to bother you with it. If it is something like this that my friends need to do. It's never a bother. Are you sure you can be friends with a bad person? I mean, yeah. I'm pretty sure I've been... I've been... She, like, hugs you and really? like, just starts crying again. <laughs> like, all the, like, tough girl elf that she you had in the city when she was your prisoner is just gone. And she's just, like, this crying mess. <laughs> Can you get? Can, can I get dressed? Yeah, yeah. Can... You kind of get like she kind of gets like shoved by one of the other guys. She's like, "Come on, hurry up!" Like, hey, well, d d calm down. Jeez. To... All right. God. Let me get dressed and everything first. Sure. Jeez. 
And I like hurry back over to the campsite, get dressed, grab my stuff, hurry back over, and follow after her. Yeah. So after a while, she you end up in the guardhouse with her. Like the space between the gates, and Atrin has like been brought as like is there. Hey, since it's daytime. Yeah. Should the darkness go away? Um. On the map. You're right. It should. <laughs> Yay! No more darkness. Uh, let's see. Global illumination. Okay. That didn't. No, nope, there's, I mean, there's still walls. There's still walls there. Oh, walls! Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how walls That's work. There. Yes. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. Am I finding the source of this music? Nope. Okay. It occurs to you that it might not be a, a source you can see. Okay. You don't have the find music spell? <laughs> so yeah, um, yeah, Atrian is, looks, like, yeah, you, you end up in the guard, the guards, the section of the guardhouse with Atrian and Vana. What are you doing, Cecilia? I'm just, I'm basically, I'm like standing like, kind of here. To uh, uh, Vana as like uh, like hey I'm here you 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 you, you do your thing. I think, I think he just looks at her for a minute and he just says, "How could? Why did he, he he's like?" And then he starts speaking under common. Shit. And he's it's very clear he's angry. And like a little bit desperate. I don't suppose you have comprehend language? Uh, I did not think that's a cleric spell. I mean, I didn't specifically. It. Yeah, I didn't okay. specifically prepare uh, it. Today, I'm just curious. So. Um, I think she's, I like... respond she's responding in Elven, so you can understand okay. her sign. And it's like, it's something to the effect of she likes, and you're getting like bits and pieces. So you're only hearing half the conversation, but she's yeah. like, Is she doing that on purpose? Probably. Like, how is this my fault? This is your fault. You made this bed. You need to lie in it now. Yeah. Uh huh. Good. I just need you to tell me you love her, and then I'll leave. I'm basically. And that being, that uh, really pisses him off. Uh. Who? What? What's Rocky's trainer's name? I forget. The dude that's just like, yeah, yeah, give him a right, give him a left. And I'm just like, yeah, that's basically me, but like in an emotional sense. Yeah, and so he like he like steps closer to her, um, and then like reaches into his belt, and then she shudders, and he pulls out like a little like like iron bar that's like yay long, like a baton, and he says something. In an undercommon, and she says, I'm sorry. What was that? He says it again, and she says, I'm sorry. And then he, like, just starts screaming at her. Okay, I step in between them now. Yeah, you get hit with a baton. <laughs> okay, he can roll to attack me, sure. Sure. All right, let me pull up his... Um... This thing. No. Yeah, so it like bounces off of you. Yeah, I think he like swipes and I just like I think I just take it off of my like shadow plate thing. <laughs> it just like yeah. yeah, it like hits and nothing happens. And just like you wanna uh you wanna uh, say that again in a language that uh, everyone here can speak. Like he's kind of snarls at you, like like in that way that someone's really angry does. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then in Elvish he says, "He said if she ever spoke to me like that again, I'd beat it out of her." 
No. No, you won't. He looks at you and he just says, you couldn't stop me if you tried and you won't. Make a constitution saving, make a charisma saving throw. Does that get it? What's the spell save DC? Ah, no, that gets it. Ha ha ha! Shit! Why are you asking us? We don't know. <laughs> so he assumes it works, and then he just raises it to start hitting her again. Uh, I, like, put my hand on his chest and, like, push him back. You get grabbed. Like, just by the two guys around you, you just get grabbed. So I need to make an athletics check to try and get away. Uh, could I make a, uh, like, a slip out of their grasp? check yeah that would be enough that that would be an uh, that would be an acrobatics i guess yeah okay. yeah so when somebody's grappling they have to use athletics but when you're doing the opposition to resist it you can do acrobatics or yeah athletics. okay i'm on fire right now <laughs> yeah so they like grab you and you like duck out of there mm -hmm. um slippery snake remember <laughs> do you say that yeah i do Um, he says something in abyssal. Okay. He says a name. Sure. And then the shadow demon appears behind you. So like John or <laughs> Harold or... Yeah, yeah. And then the shadow demon tries to grapple you. It's, uh... it's like, it's like something like... The one in the darkness that waits for fools, or something stupid like that. Uh -huh. Something really dumb and deep. Demon names. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh. Ooh. Can I? Uh. Is he a, a fiend? Is that what a demon would be? That is a fiend. Correct. Okay. Uh, I pre cast protection from evil and good, and I choose fiends. Uh, remind What's me what it? that does exactly. Uh, protection grants several benefits. Creatures of these types have disadvantages on attack rolls. Target can't be charmed, frightened, or possessed if the target is already boop 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 boop. Oh damn it! That's not the right thing. He can't. He can still hold you, and that's all right. he's trying to do right now. I forget. Oh, oh I probably don't have the one because there was one that was like. You declare can't touch you. Yeah, there was one that was like, uh, you declared it was basically the same thing of like you declare sanctuary. Search of protection. Maybe. So, yeah, there was. Yeah, it might have been that. It might be a stronger one or something like that. Yeah. So he grabs you with a seventeen. Would you like to try and get out of there now? Sure. Uh... Fuck. Yeah. So, um, he grabs you and then says something like, "Child of the snakes, you will not escape me." Like something real edge lordy and demony, <laughs> and then cut to yeah. Just I don't want to narratively describe domestic abuse, but is that when uh, Andrella sees the demon that's standing there? I don't know. What are you doing, Andrella? I was walking around the fort, being bored. Did you ever like invest? Did you ever find? Did you ever investigate the source of that singing magically? What do you mean? Exactly what I said. Did you ever like cast any spells or were you just like, where's that music coming from? I don't think I have a spell to cast. Okay. That's fair. Oh, wait, I do have a spell I can cast. Mm -hmm. Okay, wait, so, so it dawns on me that this might not be standard music. I can cast the invisibility. Correct. Yes, I do that. Yeah, there's That's a the curl. I do now. Yeah, there's a curl call just like, <laughs> As you do that, you see Kirkle, like, remove the thing from his lips, look over, hear someone scream, and then run in that direction. But he's, like, ghostly and wispy. Also, I immediately dropped the spell because that was not what I expected. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah, so you hear screaming. 
coming from the direction of the gate. Uh-huh. There's a pause, but then I start running because I was that was that was a lot of confusion and surprise, but then I start running. Cecilia, do you want to make try and make one more check? Yeah, I I was gonna say I keep trying to get out. Uh, yeah, make one more, please. Hey oh So you so you break out right as you hear like the snapping of bone as um the the knout hits um Vana's jaw. Uh, yeah, so Andrilla, you come upon you come upon a site at the guardhouse, you come upon a demon holding Cecilia, and Cecilia has just broken away, and there's a like there's clearly blood on the ground in front of her. So this is what I see. This is what you see. Okay. Um then I will cast. Yes, it is. Okay, then I will cast um, Frostbite on the demon. Because it looks to me like there's a demon that has suddenly shown up and mm-hmm. is attacking everybody, right? So yeah. I'm casting Frostbite on the demon. Uh, yeah, roll that attack roll, please. He has to make a DC 15 constitution save. Hey, oh. 2d6. Oh, man. My, my damage is bad. Four. <laughs> I'm on the GM layer. And he is disadvantaged on his next attack. Yeah, he looks at you for a second and he says something in Abyssal and Cecilia says it like, child of heaven, I will destroy you. And then he just disappears. And then- I mean, I can't understand Abyssal, so. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then- I spoke to Chronic at him too, by the way. Atrin, Atrin comes out and he's like, what was that? And he's like dragging Vana by her hair. And her jaw is clearly broken. Yeah. What? 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 Andrella. Um. I snap my fingers, and uh, her jaw starts to knit back, like like heal, because I'm gonna do healing word. Yeah. Yeah. She, her jaw starts to knit back together, and she's just sobbing uncontrollably. What is going on? This isn't. This isn't what it looks like. I was just disciplining a prisoner. I'm sorry. Would you like to roll insight? Disciplining a prisoner. Yes. Is that what you call it when you summon a demon to hold someone while you beat somebody? Is that what that is? Oh yeah, that's bullshit. Prisoner. That's bullshit. He was taking anger out on her and that is easy to see. Do your discipline practices always involve demon demon magic? I look at Cecilia and I'm like, I look back at him. This guy's supposed to be on the other layer. Boop. <laughs> He's gone now. Yeah. You summoned a demon. Andrella, just. Let's go back to my cabin. I'll, I'll explain everything. And I look at Vana. She's sobbing and bleeding and like is missing a couple teeth. Has he let go of her yet? He's still holding her hair. Uh, yeah, I, I like try to like like okay you're yeah you, you touch him and then you realize he's just holding your hair and an icing look more guilty and he lets go yeah i her head like smacks against the, the frozen ground really hard uh yeah cure wounds on her mm-hmm. good job Woo-hoo. is she back to being good or like she's still pretty hurt but she's better than she was She's not concussed anymore. Or broken jawed. Yeah, or broken jawed. She's still missing teeth. But her like defensive wounds, her like broken wrist and her cracked fingers are gone. And fella, just 
and that's when that's when that's when Matalan and Hakarta come behind you. Just say. Let the Commandant handle his business. Come with us. No, Cecilia takes her and leaves. Leave you alone? Here? I'll be along shortly. Go. I think Madelon speaks Elven. And because I don't think he realizes Andrella speaks it. I think he speaks Elvin and he says, beating your wife again, huh? Her eyes go so wide. And that's what Atrin looks pissed. And then I think she like takes a couple steps back and like the shock just turns to a look of absolute heartbreak on her face. Angela, just hear me out. I didn't have a choice. It's an arranged marriage. I'm sorry. I I only ever thought of you. Do you want me to use a zone of truth on him? Or do you not need it? Probably don't need it now. Angela, please, we're finally back together. We're finally safe. We can go back to Everdark. We can forget this ever to happen. I'll talk to my mother. We'll get this relate. We'll get the marriage annulled. It'll be fine. It'll be It'll safe. Be fine? What do you mean? Just... Why? I did. I didn't know what else to do. I'm sorry. The entire time I was with you, I was trying to get the marriage in old. I, I swear. I swear. And I look back at Vana again, and I'm like... She's, she's like... She looks terrified at you. She's like expecting you to hurt her. I love you. I still love you, Andrilla. I just... But this isn't even who you are. No, you, you've you've been with the real me. This is just, this is my mom. I promise. I I I don't. It's all gonna be okay. We're gonna go back to Everdark. It's gonna be okay. Um, what has Cecilia done? Uh, I'm. Standing there with, like, kind of just, like, with Vana, uh, like, wa waiting for you, basically. Are you, like, at the doorway leaving? I'm, we're, we're in. Are you blocked? Kind of. <laughs> I guess. We're, yeah, we're. You we're, can push what's your way. Situation? You, nobody's like gonna stop you if you try to leave with right. Vana. Like we're we're in. This... They don't really want her to get beaten any more than you do. We're in this exit, so like I'm kind of able to leave, but there's people in the way, and also I don't want to leave you alone here. So, uh, like, I guess I'm angled to leave, but I'm like clearly waiting for you. Um. Yeah. He like comes closer to you to like try and talk to you. I, I I step away. I step back again. Where do you go? Right back. Mm hmm Angela, I That's not me. That's that's ever dark. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I love you, please just Just go back to my cabin and talk. No. And I think I, at that point, I do like go to step around him. Yeah, just move how you're gonna move. Like, leave. He, he, he like doesn't like physically reach out to stop you, but he just says, I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not gonna lose you again. 
and 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 like she has tears in her eyes now and she just says I'm not even sure I was the person that you loved you were I promise you are everything's everything's a lie not everything and I just keep going He like starts yelling in Elvish. If I had skywriting, I would just put like a huge middle finger. He's like yelling at you in Elvish, and he's he's like trying to like apologize and like, like, like it's he's like going back and forth between apologizing and like shaming and like, mm-hmm. how could you like how could you walk out on this? This is nothing. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The moment he does the first shame, I stop and I turn, and like, I don't know, maybe maybe that's when I'm still pretty close to him. I stop and I turn and I've clearly turned into rage and I'm just furious anger on my face. I say, you walk away from this? This? And I point at Vana and I'm like, do you think I should stay? And as, as she's talking and there's this absolute fury in her voice, the lines on her body which she's wearing this really revealing dress, so it's pretty mm-hmm. easy to see, are glowing. Angela, please don't get angry. Just And she just keeps going, and she's like, that's your family. That's the person. I don't, arranged marriage or not. You do don't we, do Do we that. see your wings start to appear? This doesn't have wings. You don't have wings? This one does not have wings. Aw, rip. But what does happen is that light begins to brighten and pour forth from the lines and looks like the lines are like cracks in her skin. And then Mm -hmm. there's just this light shining out from inside and the light gets behind her eyes and starts shining out and it's coming out of her mouth. And then it's just this big blinding radius and um, she is using her radiant consumption Okay. Are you like trying to hurt people with it? Or are you it just does, doing it for flavor? It just does damage. It just does. It just does it damage. Just can you is. can you it's, roll that damage is. for Atrin yourself? This is not how it works. Listen. So it is angelic fury, which is yeah. painful. And um when this happens, a Syrian light just just is radiating out from her. It's, the way I'm flavoring it is basically like her soul. Yeah, so your soul is burning. Burns forth, and um, the transformation lasts for a minute or until I end it as a bonus action. I shed bright light in a 10-foot radius and dim light in an additional 10-foot radius, which sort of doesn't it's matter because it's not dark. But um, all, these, all these drow are still blinded. Yeah, so at the end of my turns, myself and every creature within 10 feet of me which I'm going to assume is also Atrin and I guess maybe two of these other people. Atrin and Cecilia um, and, and Vana and oh, and Vana. Of other people. And Cecilia, you're too close to me, <laughs> are going to take radiant damage equal to half of my level rounded up. So that's going to be three damage. Can I make a ch- now, check I, to like... Nope, this just happens. This doesn't no, like, like as the, you're like... I was going to say like here. as you're like getting angrier and light starts to like... When it starts to happen, I was gonna say maybe like scuttling away. Kind of yeah, just. I'll, I'll give I'll give that to you for narrative purposes. No, well, I'm gonna I'm I was just gonna look at Vana and be like, it, it, get back, get back. Yeah, I'll okay. I'll stay th- I'll stay within it. But yeah, I'll so Vana like, gets out like, of it. Like, get back for a second, and yeah. Um. Yeah. So this blinding light comes out. Everybody takes three damage. I take one damage because it hurts me too. Damn. Um, but I have resistance to my own damage, so I take one damage. <laughs> um, and and it just continues to burn real bright as Andrella starts a moral speech that sounds like a thing an angel would basically be bringing uh-huh. down on someone. Um, and, and she's going on about family and the, the value and importance of when someone is your family you don't you give me, do this give me the punchline give me the punchline before we go to our last break god i don't know help me 
punchline. Uh. Some type of like angel, exp- like like a condemnation from angels. Um. And therefore, your soul is dust. That seems a little harsh for her to say, but maybe it's something along the lines of, so no, we will not be together. Perfect. And then you turn around and walk away. Mm. I'm still glowing. I don't really realize I've done it. (laughs) But like every six seconds, people are taking damage. That's a good break. Let's go to break there. Excellent. Yeah. Great. On that that high water mark. (laughs) On that high water mark, we'll go to break. Okay, okay. yeah. Uh, uh, part, we will still have part three, so uh, that should be right after this, and uh, watch it at your leisure, or leisure, however you want to say it. <laughs> See you then.